Hello, Bluebeam Nation. This is Bluebeam Man coming at you. And today we're going to talk about, well, in this video, we're going to talk about rotating pages. This is a very common thing that comes up all the time, but people I see do it wrong a lot. And we should probably give you the right way how to do this. Well, at least I think this is the right way. And uh, if you like these videos, go ahead and hit like at the bottom. If you want to see more of these videos, click subscribe to my channel. You can get a whole bunch of cool stuff. Sometimes I do things other than Bluebeam, but I love Bluebeam. All right, so in rotating pages, I see some people go to document and or view, and then they'll rotate view. And this will rotate the page on this screen here but it doesn't necessarily rotate the page orientation. If you rotate the view, something really weird happens. So if you rotate the view clockwise, the markups you'll see the to actually spin them are now to the right. Well, they should always be on the top. And if you start m designing like this, it just really kind of messes up the drawing. But you'll notice on the left-hand side, if I open up my pages, this is in landscape and this is in portrait. So don't ever use rotate view if you're gonna be doing lots of markups. So I'm gonna rotate that back. And now you can see the markups are now in the upward orientation. But if you ever have a, a drawing that comes in the wrong orientation, what I'd recommend, and I probably need to get more education on why the rotate view is there. Maybe it's just if you wanna rotate a quick view in a PDF and then rotate it back, that's a piece of cake. But if you're gonna be doing a lot of markups and designing on a page, you wanna make sure everything's orientated correctly. You right click here and you can click rotate pages. And the rotate pages then lets you rotate either counterclockwise, 180, or clockwise. And so now when you rotate the pages, you'll notice that even here, the markups have switched their orientation right to top because now everything is rotated. Now, I, I would never do this in a real world scenario, but in this instance, um, everything is now switched over. So what I like to do is make sure my pages are rotated correctly before I do anything and then I go ahead and place all my markups on the pages. Now you can do that in bulk. You can also do one at a time, but totally up to you. But what I recommend, if you're gonna be doing a lot of markups on a drawing that came in the wrong way, is make sure you rotate the page first from here, rotate pages right there. And it's also under, um, where is it? It's up at the top too under batch. You can also rotate pages there as well. But so that is my recommendation on rotate pages. Please, I would say if you're gonna be doing lots of markups, don't rotate the view, rotate the page. All right, that should do it for this video today and have a good one.